everybody, welcome back to the kitchen. You may or may not know, but July 6th is National Fried Chicken Day. So what we thought we would do is put together some dipping sauces for National Fried Chicken Day. Starting with tahini. Okay, so the first one we're gonna be working on is the tahini honey Dijon sauce for fried chicken. It's easy, five ingredients, and we're done. So today we're gonna to use a squeezable tahini. Squeeze it and see how brown it is. I know I say this all the time. A little bit more. And then we're gonna whisk it into water. And again, see how dark it is. You see how dark it is. But once we start adding water, it'll lighten up. It'll lighten up and get to a, we'll get it to the consistency that we want. See how thick it gets real quick? Real, real thick. So we gotta add more water. Before we add more water, we're gonna add some of the ingredients. So we're gonna add Dijon mustard, most of it. In case we can go back, we have some extra. We have some honey. Add most of that. We're gonna whisk it in. And again, it's, it's gonna lighten up a little bit and it's gonna get to a better consistency for dipping. Pinch of salt, kosher salt, some pepper. And remember, you can add anything else to this. You can add smoked paprika, maybe some cumin, something to jazz it up a bit. But there you go. It's got the Dijon color to it. It's got a nice texture. It's dippable. Perfect. And there you have it. Tahini, honey, Dijon. And remember, everything's to taste. So you taste it at the end if you want more salt and pepper, more honey, more Dijon, whatever you like. There you go. Honey, Dijon, tahini sauce. So the first one we did earlier was the, the honey, Dijon, tahini sauce dip. Very good. Uh, earlier we did an Asian sriracha, which had soy sauce, rice wine vinegar, sriracha, garlic, and ginger, just to name a few. And then now we're gonna go into our barbecue, um, tahini barbecue chipotle. So as always, we start with Mighty Sesame Tahini. And we're gonna mix a little water, whisk, I know I say this every time, whisk, it breaks, it changes colors, and it really thickens up, as you can see. I'm gonna add some more water. And we add the water, but I think it'll stay thick. And it'll thicken up, but also some of the, we're gonna put barbecue sauce in here. We're gonna do a little, a little bit of sour cream just to give it some, some body to it and flavor. And then we have the, the barbecue sauce as well. And then we're going to finish it with some sweet habanero sauce we have here as well. And of course, salt and pepper to taste. First, the barbecue sauce. And I know I say this all the time, but it's up to you on how much you want to add. It's up to you, your flavor. So when I say salt and pepper to taste, that also means barbecue sauce to taste, or sour cream to taste, or salt and pepper to taste. Your preference. Dollop of sour cream. Okay, maybe just a little pepper, salt, a little kosher salt, black pepper. There you go. Mighty sesame tahini barbecue chipotle and at the end we're gonna add a little bit of sweet habanero just a, just a couple this is to be hot and again it depends on if you like it hot or not so hot okay there you have it we have the honey Dijon tahini sauce Asian sriracha tahini sauce and the uh, barbecue chipotle tahini sauce with a couple of Splashes of the sweet habanero. 
All good for dipping. So let's give it a shot. You know me, I'm not shy. Let's do this. Mmm, that's good. Mmm, that's good.